two democracies of the world the world's largest democracy and the world's oldest democracies are coming together gradually just a few months back prime minister modi had an official visit to usa during that visit india had signed various important deals out of this the most important one is the deal of HAL and GE Aeronautics Private Limited, which I had talked about in my previous episode. Here in this episode, we will talk about that how the defense relationship between the India and USA had developed. Let's talk about some key facts from this deal. So the key facts are: they held the inauguration of initiative on critical emerging technology. Number two, India and USA are collaborating in sectors like space, space technology. Uh, defense etc nasa and isro are expected to develop a strategic framework for human space flight cooperation by the end of 2023 and india and usa had signed a mou concerning about semiconductor supply chain and let's talk about that what kind of deals happened in defense sector so in defense as we see that india and india and uh, usa had always been in the defense sector as far as uh it it's concerned it it participated through ministerial dialogues 2 plus 2 joint exercises etc so like i said the important deal as far as the defense sector is concerned is general electronics the deal of your general electronics and hal which which actually will help the manufacturing of f414 engines for hindustan aeronautics limited for light combat aircraft mark 2 then we have india and usa will launch index x which will promote the joint defense technology innovation co production of advanced defense technology so the in, in index x it will work india and usa will collaborate together if we look into the history the relationship between these two countries were not so friendly initially when india got independence in 1947 India decided to be the part of non-aligned movement which means that India would maintain her neutrality. In the initial stage USA had helped India in various sectors. Uh India ha- USA had helped India in establishing IITs Indian Institute of Technology. It also helped India um in in green revolution. But after the 70s um the relationship between these two countries became bitter uh during the 71 war india and usa were on the verge of attacking uh, were on the verge of war and india got closure um to soviet union which add more f- fuel to this hostility and as far as the um the nuclear program is concerned so usa was a very big critic of of the in of india's nuclear program and hence usa had imposed sanctions on india in 1998 the situation started to change post 90s when economic revolution had begun in india india emerged as a big market for united states uh in the 90s it revolution also boomed which supplied cheap labor to united states and slowly as we see that indian diaspora became strong in united states in the 2000s world trade center was attacked by al qaeda india which saw the terrorist attack in 1990s um and in 2001 uh, parliament attack also happened since both of the countries were victim of terrorism a new dawn of relationship began between these two countries india and usa's defense relationship are based on the basic ideologies that both of these countries share that is freedom and democracy along with that we share some security interests with each other so one is maintaining security and stability two defeating terrorism and violent religious extremism uh preventing uh, spreading of weapons 
then protecting trade and commerce at sea, uh, at sea lanes. The defense relationship between India and USA had started with a great minute signed on 1995. Ten years later, in 2005, India and USA signed new framework for India-US defense relationship and which was signed for, ten, for the next 10 years. This gave a road map of the defense relationship between these two countries that how these countries will conduct themselves. Um, it includes uh, provisions like joint exercises, defense deals, strengthening their military capabilities etc. Then comes another step which will help both countries to overcome their hurdles as far as the defense relationship is concerned. So in 2012 the, de the Department of Defense created a mechanism for overcoming or reducing the bureaucratic hurdles and this will help in smoothening the relationship between these two nations as far as the defense deals are concerned. On June 7, 2016, Pre President Barack Obama and Prime Minister Narendra Modi had announced the recognition of the fact that India as, as a major defense partner of United States. In 2018, India and USA had signed uh, an agreement called COMCASCA. COMCASCA stands for Communication Compatibility Security Agreement and this is signed for the purpose of selling high-end technology to the allies of USA. Actually COMCASCA is the Indian specific version of Communication and Information on Security Memorandum and Agreement. This allows India to procure transfer of specialized equi equipment for encrypted communication for the United States origin military like C-17, C-130 and P-81. Then again, LEMOA was signed between USA and India. The agreement that establishes basic basic terms and and produces for the reciprocal of the provision of the logistics support supplies and services between the armed forces of india and united states then let's talk about the katsa the countering america america's adversaries through the sanctions act katsa is a united states federal law that imposed um, sanctions on Iran, North Korea and Russia. In 2018, USA exempt India from Katsa for purchasing S-400 missiles um, from the Russian defense system. So, so these deals are some are few examples that to prove that how India and USA uh, how the defense relationship between these two countries are coming closure. Um, also, if if we look as uh, if we look the Quad Alliance, so Quad is also uh, the active defense alliance where India uh, became a member of that. Um, well, in this episode, we only talked about. Um, specific, specifically the defense relationship between these two countries that how it started and beca because earlier uh, the relationship between these two countries were quite hostile there were misunderstanding and now India and USA are becoming strategic allies they are coming together so um, so I also I always wanted to make an episode on the fact that that from where it started um, so here you, you will find some brief context behind it and and we have discussed some some important um, deals uh, that happened in past two decades which actually defined the defense relationship between the strategic relationship between India and USA um, are concerned. So, so tell me that if, if you like this video, if, if you like a niche oriented video or do you want a holistic video where I, where I talk about um, the India-US relationship as a whole, 
uh, because then another topic can also uh, is also coming to my mind where india and usa are going to have um had had signed a space deal also so the space co cooperation uh, also be, uh, all can be an important topic so tell me and if you have any suggestions for another video um you, uh, you guys are you, are, you guys are welcome to suggest that um tell me that whether you like this video or not because i came after a very very long break so yeah stay tuned